think where maths gets a bad name and where it falls apart is the, the classic 25 examples sort of teaching where you're shown one example and asked to do 25 questions. I think that's where people become disengaged and when they can't do question one or question two or question three, they decide that they can't do maths. And that's, that's an issue. An engaging maths lesson should have, it should be discursive. There should be modeling of good examples, but in modeling examples, we should be asking lots of questions of the students and really probing the students uh, and testing, do they have that depth of understanding to take this to the next level? Maths should all be about how you think, not just the knowledge that you have. I'm certain that everyone can be good at maths. <laughs> I think the people who will struggle to get good at maths are people who think they can't get good at maths. I think our jobs as maths teachers is helping people understand that maths is not a subject that is for the few, it's for everyone. Everyone can get good. It's very much a, a mindset um, that we need to establish. I say patterns, framework, and constructivist. For me, maths is very much about patterns. If you can see patterns in maths and you can create layers of ab abstraction, then you're really thinking about something on a deep level. Next, I would say a framework. I think maths is a structured framework that allows you to think beyond things that you can see or feel. And for my third word, I would say constructivist. I'd use a word that describes maths real nature. So maths is built upon layers of prior knowledge and prior thinking and pre-existing understanding. But you can develop something which is more and more interesting from the small, the axioms, from the building blocks and create really interesting theorems. What's really interesting about math is being able to spot patterns. Now, it might be numerical, and that's predominantly what you would look at when you study maths at school. Beyond that, if you, if you wanted to study law, if you wanted to be a really effective geophysicist, you want to be able to spot patterns in things. That's inherently what maths is about. Mm -hmm.